they'll soon start appearing together on Channel 10's The Project. But it appears Lisa Wilkinson and her new The Project co-star Pete Hellier have already hit it off, with the pair taking time to meet up while taking separate vacations in Hawaii. Taking to their respective accounts on Friday, the new colleagues shared snaps of themselves posing together in the tourist hotspot. Pete couldn't be missed in his statement making Hawaiian shirt and looked very animated while he made a number of hand gestures. Meanwhile, Lisa, wearing a glamorous navy dress, switched between smiling broadly and making an exaggerated expression while biting her nail. Comedian Pete admitted it was a recent missile scare on the Pacific Island that got the two of them deep in conversation. Here I am telling new cast member Lisa Wilkinson about my recent Hawaiian sick missile scare. Can't wait to tell her more about it in 2018 and beyond. The snap prompted the comedian's followers to speak of their own experience of a missile scare, which occurred when a U.S. federal government employee accidentally sent a text alert for an impending missile strike. Despite the ominous warning that spread panic across the island, it was soon to be a false alarm. We are in Hawaii too and still talking about the ballistic missile. I think my heart rate has just returned to normal. One fan wrote. Another added, I was there too. Didn't know a thing. I was laying on Waikiki Beach. The Project star has recently been spending time in the USA with her husband Peter Fitzsimmons, while Pete Hellier has also been hanging out stateside for the past week. Lisa was previously snapped in New York City, booking into the Ritzy Crosby Street Hotel, where rooms can cost up to $4,250 a night. The 58-year-old shared photos of the hotel too, ensuring her followers knew the post was not sponsored and expressed her excitement to be staying in an expensive hotel. Managed to escape New York just before the shocker storm hit but had the best time. Just love that city. And love the Crosby Street Hotel. Thanks for a fabulous stay, she captioned the shots. The pictures featured luxurious lounge chairs and intricate artworks hanging on red-painted walls. Views from the window of the lower Manhattan block looked out over snow-covered buildings, making it a serene experience. Lisa's husband Peter is shown in one of the pictures, peering at his laptop screen quite seriously. It seemed to be one last trip overseas before the veteran magazine editor makes her debut on the project panel on January 28. The new role comes after she quitting her high-profile Today gig with rival Network 9 in October after failing to achieve pay parity with co-host Carl Stefanovic.